the bills really complicated. Can you explain or simplify what it is that you're referring to? Um, we are referring to voters whether or not that they should have a sales and service tax on their health care. That's what the bill does. There's a tax on PEB, which is a general fund transfer of $12 million. There is a 1.5% insurance tax on anybody who's buying their own health care premiums, whether that's individuals, people in the small group market. If you look at how much money the insurance tax raises, it's supposed to raise in the first biennium $78 million. $25 million of that's going to come out of the K-12 budget because in the large group market are our public schools. So that's a problem. You know, when we're talking about, you know, schools that are still, even with an $8.2 billion education budget, schools that are still laying off teachers and trying to figure out calendars for next year in this biennium, and we're taking $25 million to cost shift to Medicaid, you know, to cover up for the 55,000 people who were on Medicaid who weren't, you know, eligible, uh, and, and we overpaid all these Medicaid profiteers. It's like, come on, really? So, you know, there's a tax in, on the Medicaid providers themselves. We feel that that's almost fraudulent, uh, and we're researching that with the federal government. How can we possibly double dip and charge taxes on money that was already tax money, was already matched to the federal government for Medicaid? And we're going to try to you know, sneaky go in and try to get more money from that. And then, of course, there's the tax on hospitals. And so, um, you know, if you break your arm, it's just going to cost you more. It's going to cost you more in a copay or a direct pay if you don't have the insurance uh, to pay for that and you're paying cash for it. You, just taxing health care is not the way to make health care more affordable. And, and so, you know, we just, that's what it is. It's a sales and service tax on our, on, on, on our health care, and we're just opposed to that.